bless you, Lord, we bless you, Jehovah. We we ni we wa peke. Akuna wa kulinga ni shwa na we we mungu wetu. Una ye ye yusha milima kamanta. Kuta za gereza, za tikisika. Ah, kwa sifa za ko Jehovah. Ni nini iliongumu mbele za ko mungu wangu. Ah, wewe ulie pasua bahari ya shamu. Wana Israeli wakapicha katika inchi kabu. Wewe ulie wapa. Wana Israeli mana pale jangwani. Wewe ndiwe mungu tunaye abudu. Wewe ndiwe mungu tunaye inua aduhuri ya leo. Shuka na wezo wako. Shembelea kila moja. Ambaye anakiu katika moyo wake. Ah, Jehova na kuabudu na kutukuza na kuinulia mikono nikisema hakuna kama wewe Mungu wetu Oh shatabaya ripaladaya kosi andereba reka chala masecheria na laboza shekecheria na la mama sanda ripapa shekecheria na we worship you in the spirit in the truth we worship you Lord We enter through the blood of the Lamb. We enter to worship you only. Oh. We enter to honor I am. We enter the holy of holy Lord. We enter through the blood of the Lamb. We enter to worship you only, Lord. We enter to honor I am. We enter. We enter the holy of holy. We enter through the blood. Through the blood of the Lamb, we enter to worship. We enter to worship you only. We enter to honor. We enter to honor. We enter the holy. We enter. Yeah.
to worship you holy we enter to worship you holy we enter to honor I am Lord I worship you Lord I worship lift up your hands to him We worship you, Lord. We worship you, Holy God. We give you glory, Lord. Awesome God you are. Mighty God you are. You do glorious things. Ah, Lord, you're filled with splendor and majesty. There is no one like you, O oh God. Nothing is impossible with you, O oh God. Nothing is impossible with you, O oh God. We thank you because, Lord, you are able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above that which we ask or even imagine. We thank you for your grace. We thank you. You are able, God. We give you praise, O oh God. Oh,
kukushin la kukushi yesu e yes come on celebrate the lord
celebrate the Lord. Hallelujah. We give you glory. Hallelujah. Oh, we give you glory, Lord. Jehovah Shama. Lord, you're ever present with us. With you, nothing is impossible. We stand in your awesome presence. We thank you for the Holy Spirit. We thank you for your word. We thank you for the power that traced up Jesus from the dead. That same power is present in our midst. You are the God of wonders. You are the God of miracles. You are the God of signs. We magnify your holy name. And we celebrate your goodness in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Elohim. Adonai. Shama, Shama, Elohim, hey, Adonai, Shama, Shama, Elohim, oh, Elohim, hey, Adonai, 
Shama, Shama. Let's give a crop to Jesus and a shout of victory, a shout of triumph, a shout of victory. Hallelujah. Blessed be God and the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ who has blessed us with all spiritual blessings in heavenly places in Christ Jesus who daily loads us with benefits. Praise the name of the Lord. Turn to your neighbor, give them a high five, tell them I'm here to be loaded with benefits. I'm here to be loaded with benefits. Declare I will be profitable. I will be profitable. I will be usable. I will be usable. I will add value. I will add value to the glory of his name. To the glory of his Thank name. you. Be seated with a great smile. What a beautiful day. Thank you, Pastor Shadrach, for leading us so ably together with the other singers. What a joy for you to precede the priest, even as a manner of sacrifice. We want to acknowledge the presence of Bishop Sammy Minor and the wife, right in our midst. Thank you for coming over, sir, to fellowship with us. To God be glory. Amen. We are so privileged to be in such a season as now. We know it's our season of growth, our season of expansion, and our season of fruitfulness. If that is your season, shout a big hallelujah. hallelujah. I say it, shout a bigger hallelujah. hallelujah. And we have come a long way, even by the God of heaven. Whatever we are seeing in our lives is as a result of God's word in our hearts. And we are beginning another series. Amen? We have just finished another series, and I'm sure you have been able to follow. And we are beginning another series today. I'll continue on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and so on. Because I sense we need to come to a place of encounter. A place of encounter. I'm be speaking on the subject of the God of miracles signs and wonders the god of miracles signs and wonders and today it is going to be very spectacular because by the god of heaven we are here to terminate demonic arrests and threats from the kingdom of darkness amen say to terminating demonic arrests and threats from the kingdom of darkness. Amen. Acts chapter number 4, verse 29 to 30. Acts chapter number 4, verse 29 to 30. And the Lord, and now Lord, look upon their threats and grant to your servants to continue to speak your word with all boldness. While you stretch out your hand to heal and signs and wonders are performed through the name of, our, of your holy servant, Jesus. Father, we delve in getting to know who you are. For your character defines the characteristics of our lives. And as your word says through Isaiah 8 and verse number 18, that here I am and the children the Lord has given me are for signs and wonders. In Israel from the Lord of hosts who dwells on Mount Zion. 
We ask that in the name of Jesus that will not only hear about the God of miracles, signs and wonders, but we shall carry a testimony that this is our God and he will be our God even to the end of life. We therefore pray that as we enter to study, may we be ushered into a dimension of walking in the miraculous. This we ask and we pray in Jesus' mighty name. God has ordained miracles, signs and wonders to be part of his identity. God has ordained that miracles, signs and wonders will be his characteristics. For he said to Jeremiah, Behold, I am the Lord God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? There are two words that we drive the word miracle. I don't have to mention there's a Greek word called uh, thou resim and a Hebrew word called ness. And this talks about an occurrence that cannot be explained by human standards or cannot be achieved through the human ability. And as we stand today to begin this subject, God has ordained that his character, God has ordained that his identity will be signs, miracles, and wonders. And so, besides ordaining that, he has also ordained that miracles, signs, and wonders should be our credentials. Amen? Should be our credentials. I think I need an interpreter. Some of this term needs to be explained in Kiswahiri. Amen. You know, when you are laying a foundation, you are never in a hurry. Because the rest of the building is going to rest on it. God has ordained that his character will be that of miracles, signs, and wonders. That means as God liveth, miracles, signs, and wonders shall be his character. He has also ordained that miracles, signs, and wonders be our credentials. I would imagine the woman who was healed of her issue of blood for 12 years. Everywhere she went, people said, that is a woman who was healed of the issue of blood for 12 years. Time has come for people to identify us with what God has done. And to borrow this phrase, what God can do, no man can do. May you be identified with that which no man can be able to do. May they say no man can do such things unless God 
be with him. I decree by the God of heaven that your identity and your credentials shall be what God has done. Many of us have been known by what the enemy did. But I see what the Lord is turning your life around. Some of you could be known by the name of your poverty in the old age. You could have been known by having failed. You could have been known by your mistake. But God intention is that you shall be known by the credentials of miracles, signs and wonders. I decree by the God of heaven that these shall be your credentials. Praise the name of the Lord. For God ordains you and your children to be for signs, miracles, and wonders. That is why he says in Isaiah 18 and verse number 12, Thou shalt not call conspiracy what others call conspiracy. Thou shalt not fear what others fear because your credentials are supposed to be opposite of what the world fears. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Well, this morning has gone up with a lot of money. It's now 210, 210 shillings, but we shall not call conspiracy what others call conspiracy because the God we serve is a God of miracles, signs and wonders. We shall not be afraid of what they are afraid because our credentials are to walk through the fire, to go through the waters, even to survive in difficult times. We serve a God who is a miracle worker. We serve a God who is a sign sure. We serve a God who is a wonderful worker. And David says, even, even unto the latter days, praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Thou shalt not call conspiracy. If you be a son of God, you are for signs. You are for miracles. You are for wonders. In the name of Jesus, I pray that the grace, the grace that causes your credential, your identification will be Sisiniware Walio Saidiwa Namungu wa Israeli. God has ordained that at times when we are threatened he steps in with miracles signs and wonders. I want to say to us today I understand by the spirit that we are in a season where we are threatened. Even as Peter and John they have just healed a cripple because they are out in their own business as usual of demonstrating the power of God. And they raised up a cripple who had stayed at the gate called Beautiful for over 38 years. They were arrested and taken before the Sanhedrin. 
And the Bible says they were questioned. Please explain to us what you did to a cripple who has sat in that place for over 38 years. The Bible says for now he was 40 years. What is this power? What is this name? They asked for two things. Tell us the power you used. Tell us the name that you used. Because this is not normal. This is not normal. There is a power responsible for raising a cripple who was 40 years begging and now he is following after you. Tell us what you did. In what name did you do? And the Bible tells us they answered unto them it is in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And we want to let you also know that same Jesus that same Jesus that same Jesus is the one you crucified but that same power is not only able to heal is able to raise from the dead that same power of that we raise the cripple with is able to raise this man who was dead in the name of Jesus. And the Bible tells us, you crucified him, but God raised him up. And they say today, it is by the same power, by the same name, that this man who has been crippled for 40 years is now standing as evidence. Is now standing as evidence. We are carriers of exhibits. I said you shall be a carrier of exhibit of what God has done because there is power in the name of Jesus. Not only power to heal but also to raise and it can raise a dead business. It can raise a dead church. It can raise a dead marriage. It can raise a dead economy. It can raise a dead relationship. The same of name of Jesus. By it we are healed. By it we are restored. By it we are strengthened. Praise the name of the Lord. And the Bible tells us. He told, they told and they said unto him. This is a stone which was rejected by the builders but now has become a chief cornerstone. And I want to let you know it is not only miracles. By this name you can be redeemed from the curse and the power of sin. For there is no other name by which men must be saved. So this name is able to save. This name is able to heal. This name is able to resurrect. There is power in the name of Jesus. Beloved, I want to let you know the Sanhedrin looked at them and the Bible says they noticed these men were uneducated. This power works for everybody. It is not by your credentials. It is not by your education background. It is not by the experiences. They saw the boldness. This power gives you the boldness. This power gives you the miracle working power. And the Bible says they were uneducated. You might not be educated, but God has ordained for you 
I'm not saying education is bad. But it is not the credentials by which we go. Let me stop at bed today. For the sake of what I have said, let me congratulate all my fellow engineers. Because today is the day we celebrate engineers in the world. I salute you, my fellow engineers. May you continue serving our nation and the world at large. And may you raise up structures in the built environment which will not cause the loss of life. Let's continue being strong. So education is not bad. Nevertheless, it's not a credential by which we go through this life. There is a higher power. And the Bible says they were uneducated. They were untrained. And they marveled. And they asked and they realized they had been with the same Jesus who we killed and who has been raised up. So the same power the same credentials that were on Jesus are now on them. And now on them. And now on them. And the Bible tells us just by, just by them being uneducated, even without the formal training, they had a power that backed them and produced evidence. And that same power Na hizo hizo nguvu. that backs us and produces evidence Na is the God of miracles signs and wonders. And the Bible tells us they were threatened at that point. And they were told do not speak in that very name. But the Bible tells us the evidence was already there. May God give you a reason to silence your critics. May God give you a miracle that when they see it, for they said, what shall we do to them? Seeing that the very man that was crippled is already with them. I pray, oh God, May you give somebody an evidence. May there be a carrier of your credentials that when their critics look at them, they shall be silent forever. Praise the name of the Lord. I want to say to us, they said we cannot silence them because the miracle is noticeable among all. And they released them to go. Because God had backed his word. God had defended his name. And rescued his servants. I pray that right now. Even by the God of heaven. Each and every one of us. Who is been under the arrest of the enemy and has been threatened in whatever way. Right in this meeting, you will carry the credentials. Somebody never heard me. I say right in this meeting, you will step out with proof. You will serve out, you will work out with the credentials that you serve the God of miracles, signs and wonders because right now we are terminating every demonic arrest. You can be arrested in matters of hell. My, your mind could be arrested. Your ability could be arrested. Either because of this one thing or another. But I say to us today, if there be any sickness and disease that has arrested you, today is the day for it to release you. 
If witchcraft and sorcery has put shackles on your feet and on your hand, even in your mind and your spirit, it is a day to terminate every arrest. Because as for me and the children that God has given us, we are for signs and wonders. We shall carry the credentials of what the Lord has done. And we shall announce to the people, come and see what the Lord has done. Come and see what the Lord has done. Beloved, I want you to understand. You could be arrested psychologically. I sense there are people here who are facing a mind block. You cannot think appropriately. I decree right now every demonic arrest, every mental arrest, every spiritual arrest, every financial arrest, every demonic power that has arrested even your business by the same God who raised up this cripple who had been there for 40 years let the power be released upon you now let the power be released upon you now let the power be released upon you now I set you free I set you free I set you free I set you free in the name of Jesus from every arrest, from every arrest, from every arrest, every demonic oppression, every demonic oppression, psychologically, mentally, I command it to lose on you now. Let it lose on you now. Let it lose on you now. Be free. Be free. Be free. In Jesus' name. Please understand. Why would God? Let me give you two reasons. Why is God liberating us? Where, why is God working out miracles? And why should we walk in miracles? I want to give you two, only two or three reasons. God wants to prove. Please understand. God wants to prove that he is the only true and living God. God does miracles. God does signs and wonders to prove to the world that he is the only true and living God. And what he does, no one else can do. May that serve up as a purpose in your life. That only God can do what he has done. Only God can set you from that kind of an arrest. The second reason God wants to prove that every word he has spoken concerning any situation is true. It's true. When God heals, he is out to prove that he sent his word to heal us. He is, you know, he is proving to us that the word spoken in scripture is now true. May God heal you so that he may prove that by his stripes you were healed. May God heal you so that he may prove he is Jehovah Rapha. May God raise you up to prove that he is the lifter of our heads. May God fight your battles so that he is proving that he is a mighty man of war. May God set you free so that he is proving that Jesus came to set the captives free. I pray that you will become evident that the word of God is true. 
may you become evidence that God is the only true and living God. Praise the name of the Lord. The woman said, I've gone to many physicians. I've spent my money, but I never got healed because no other person other than Jesus ever made a claim that I came to set the captives free. May God's word be proven over your life. May you become the evidence that the word of God is true. I say may you become the expert. Declare I'll become the expert. Declare I'll become the expert. I'll become the evidence that the word of God is true. Is true. I'm an expert. When the Bible says that the Lord is able to make his grace abound towards us all so that we have all things in sufficiency enough for every good work. I am an expert. I'm an expert that God can deliver from depression. I suffered depression in form three. I'll not even cross the road because I was fearful. Because death was by my side. I remember I never crossed the road, a tarmac road for one year. Mzinione <laughs> But I am an expert that God is the lifter of our men. Listen to me as I finish. God will work out miracle signs and wonders so that he may back his word. And not only back his word so that he can redeem his name. Ah, come, on. come on. So that he may redeem his name. The name of the Lord is always at stake. But he will never let his name be put to shame. He will Swing into action. Lift up your hand and say, For the sake of your name. For the sake of your name. Lord, may you swing into action. Lord, may you swing into action. May you back your word. May you back your word. May you back your name. May you back your name. May you prove through me. May you prove through me. That you are the only true and living God. That you are the only true and living God. If you want to be an expert, stand up on your feet. I don't want to threaten your life. But I can guarantee to you from this place that the God of heaven is the God of miracles, signs and wonders. And from today you are being marked. You are being marked as proof, as evidence, as an evidence of God who works out miracles, signs and wonders. If there is any area you have been threatened, I tell you by the God of heaven and if I be a man of God you will stand on the other side of the threat and you will do what they did they said Lord see their threats and grant that that which was threatening them be behind their back and that miracles signs and wonders may be expedited by your servants. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus, I honor you because you are a God who has ordained miracles, signs and wonders as your credentials. 
and not only that our father but you have ordained us our God to be carriers of miracles to carry it as our credential to carry it as our sign to carry it as a wonder whatever has threatened your people be it sickness and disease be it shackles of witchcraft and sorcery be it sin and evil habits be it demonic oppression or depression right now I arise in the name of Jesus by which we are saved by which we are healed by which we are delivered by which we are raised from the dead right now I declare in the name of Jesus let it happen now I break every arrest I overthrow every address I overrule every arrest and in the name of Jesus right now I declare let every threat let every threat find its match find its match in the name of Jesus and right now I release the power of Jesus the power in the name of Jesus over your life over your family over your ministry over your career and I declare let miracles let signs let wonders be your credentials be your credentials be your credentials be your credentials in the name of Jesus 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 yes 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 be healed be delivered be set free be liberated be raised up in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus receive it now receive it now receive it now receive it now miracle working power miracle working power in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus father we give you praise we honor you today that this is our identification mark. We shall not be identified with diseases. We shall not be identified with failed business. We shall not be identified with broken marriages. We shall not be identified with the churches which failed. We shall not be identified with the people that have failed. For we are walking in power. We are working in miracles. We are working in favor. In the name of Jesus. To the glory of your name. We give you all the glory. We give you all the praise. We give you all the honor. You are our God. The God of miracles. The God of signs. The God of wonders. You are our God. From now and forever from now and forever Lord irrespective of the economy we shall not call conspiracy what others call conspiracy for you are still our shepherd you are still our God and we are the just and we shall live even by faith receive all the praise receive all the glory receive all the honor receive all the worship for what you have done for us in Jesus name Amen, Amen. Declare in the name of Jesus. I am a sign and a wonder. I walk in miracles. I walk in power.
not be identified with a failed business. You will not be identified with a failed marriage. You will not be identified. No, no. You will be identified. Kama yue alie pona. Amen. Yes. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. See, mpaka jioni. Lakini kwa sababu ya masandi yo sisi hao. But I'll be on this topic until you become an evidence. Paka ufanyike shahidi. Kama ni kuwa mweupe, utakuwa mweupe. Diyo ukue evidence. Amen. Kama ni mugu moja fupi, itarefuka, ili ukue evidence. Kama ni macho hayoni, itaona, diyo ukue evidence. Amen. Mungu tu aguze ile kitu ambacho watu wanakujua nayo na ni mbaya akuondole. Amen. Bwana atukuzwe. Amen. Mimi nilijulikana. Ai, hakuna time. Tulete sadaka. Nilijulikana kama kijana ya mama aliye masikini sana. Mtu mmoja akaniambia si kwanza muende Muzibe ile cracks iko kwa miguu ya mama yenu na mashiringi. When I preach this, I don't preach the orange. I'm enough proof Amen. of what God can do. Kama ni aibu atakuondolea. Amen. Kama ni fedhe hata kuondole. Amen. Kama ni kutabika hata kuondole. Amen. Oyu yonewe gai wito. Uyo diye mungu wetu. Ginya tene na tene. Paka mwisho. This is our God. Uyo diye mungu wetu. Even unto the grave. Paka kaburini. Ata kaburini badu watakuwa mungu wetu. Amen. Kwa sababu ziku ya kufufuka ikifika tutafufuka. Amen. Kwa sababu uyo diye mungu wetu. Amen. Tuliambia wajana. Ya kwamba Kenyans we are poor in offerings. Tuliambiwa jana ya kwamba wa Kenya hawatoi sadaka vizuri. Lakini we have turned the tide. Lakini tumebadilisha hilo wingu. Amen. Amen. We have turned the tumebadilisha hilo wingu. So we do it well. Kwa hivyo tunaileta vizuri. To the glory of his name. Kwa utukufu wa jina lake. I'm sorry for the time the way it has gone. But when you are on fire, you want to see change. Amen. Amen. Invariable, inarguable change. Amen. Amen. To let us adaka. We are a chosen generation, called for to show His excellence. All I require for life, God has given me, and I know who I am. We are a chosen generation. We are a chosen generation. Call for to show His excellence. All I require for life, God has given me, and I know who I am. I know who God says I am. What He says I am. Where he says I'm half, I know who I am. I know who God says I am. What he says I am. Where he says I'm half, I know I'm walking. I'm walking in power. I'm walking in miracles. I live a life of favor. Cause I know I'm walking. I'm walking in power. I'm walking in miracles. I live a life of favor. Cause I know who I am. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. On Monday, I'm giving you eight reasons why God works out in miracles. And you will quit the club of living a miraculous life. People will look at you and just see you as a wonder. May you become a sign Amen. in the marketplace. And now may the Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. The Lord shine his countenance.